Welcome to Las Vegas. Summer League is upon us again. It's, of course, the NBA season and the uh, G League season done, but uh, not much time for uh, Nate Ranking and the rest of the coaching staff to uh, get the guys ready, but you're here. How excited are you now to see what the guys can do? Oh, very excited. I mean, it's great being out in this atmosphere and around all the Cavs coaches again. Um, and then we got some of our guys here, so it, it's a really special time for me and, and just seeing how, how well they do. And you know the beauty of, of having a G League team, and it is the G League now, not the D League now with the, with the sponsorship. But having the symmetry of, of Tyler and the coaching staff feeding down to you, how much does that help? That's huge. Um, just being around the championship culture and the knowledge these guys have, I'm just trying to soak it all in, and uh, you know just take you know just a small bout down the Canton with us, and, and hopefully you know keep the, co the coherency on both sides. Obviously, you know a lot about Kay Felder, coached him down there and then coached against Eddie Tavares. But this this is a very important time for both these young guys, don't you think? Both young guys, um, and this is a place to showcase. Mm -hmm. Eddie was huge in the D-League for, uh, for Toronto. They won it all. Uh, and Kay was just special when he came down for us in Canton and just got us on a roll there and got us into the playoffs. So to see these guys on the same squad now, it's kind of fun for me and uh, just to see what they do against other guys. You know, fans didn't get a chance to see Eddie much at the NBA level, the one game at the end of the year, but what did you see in him as an opposition player for the 905 group that, that really jumped out? Just uh, he fits in. I mean, he's mm -hmm. seven, you know, over seven foot fall, but right. he just fits into a team, and he does a lot of the little things. I mean, his size just affects everything, and just him mucking up the paint and, and guys having to come in there and, and finish over top of him. He just affects the game in so many different ways. And what's the message that you impart to Roosevelt Jones, Joe Beverly, guys that you, you've had with the charge to now really showcase themselves here in Las Vegas? I just say be yourself. Mm -hmm. um, do what you did in Canton and the way those guys fit in, in Canton and the roles they fit. They fit on any squad, just how hard they play and the teamwork that they bring to each they just make it special for the other guys they play around. And if they're just themselves, it just makes it a lot easier for, you know, the team to build that chemistry. And you got to be proud of the fact that your, your coaching staff basically is here to be able to soak up as much knowledge as, as possible. Like I said, it's huge. Yeah. I mean, this is an extreme honor to be in the Cleveland mm -hmm. organization. Um, and just to have uh, my staff and myself here, like I said, just soaking it up, um, learning as much as we can, and, and hopefully we can translate that down into the G League. And then one final point, when they roll the ball out now for these games, I mean, you want to try to win them. Yes, yeah. Yeah. that's what, that's yeah. our job. That's our <laughs> job. Uh, teach them as much as you can in these this short amount of time and then get the Ws when we hit the floor. Great. Thanks, Nate. Appreciate Thank you. It. Nate Ranking, our guest here in Vegas.